Welcome to this coding project on the Matterplot set. As you can see in the animation, the Matterplot set is a complex mathematical object that can be visually represented through coding. Let's dive into the code and see how we can create our own Matterplot set visualizer. First, we have our setup section where we import the necessary libraries and set some variables like the center, radius and number of iterations. This is where you can play around with the settings to zoom in on different sections of the set. Next we have the function to get the complex plane. This is where we create an array of x and y coordinates and convert them into a complex number. This is the foundation for our Mandelbrot set. To verify that our complex plane is set up correctly, we plot the real and imaginary parts of the plane. This just gives us a visual representation of the coordinates we are working with. Now we have the function that is applied to the complex plane multiple times. This is where the magic happens, and the Mandelbrot set starts to take shape. We use a simple function that squares the complex number and adds the original complex coordinate. By applying this function multiple times, we can see which coordinates escape to infinity and which ones stay within a certain limit. The coordinates that stay within the limit are considered to belong to the Mandelbrot set, the coordinates that escape to infinity are not part of the set and are usually colored with fancy colors depending on how long it takes for the function to realize that a point does not belong in the set. Finally, we put it all together and plot the final image of the Mandelbrot set. And voila! Our very own visual representation of the Mandelbrot set. Feel free to play around with the settings and see what interesting patterns you can find. Stay tuned for the next part of this series where we take this code and turn it into an interactive app. Imagine being able to zoom in and out and explore different sections of the Mandelbrot set with the click of a button. See you in the next video.